So I kind of wanted to show you guys my collection of the Wet n Wild lipsticks that are $1.99. You can get them at um, Kmart, Walgreens, Rite Aid, Walmart, um, essentially any drugstore or supermarket kind of place. I think they pretty much all stock them. But this first one here, I'm going to do lip swatches and swatches on my hand. So this first one is Pink Sugar. It's 900B. That is the swatch on my hand and here it is on my lips. This one isn't necessarily one that I would typically wear on its own. I would probably use this one um, just as kind of a base and then use a lighter lip gloss on the top like a pink lip gloss or like an orange one. This next one is 903C, just peachy. And as you can tell, it definitely has a little bit more pink in it than the first one. And this one, I probably would feel more comfortable wearing it alone. These are a matte opaque formula, but um, I find that they're not really too drying on the lips as long as you moisturize um, before with like a lip balm of some sort. And I don't usually wear a lip liner with these, but that's just me. Next up, I have 901B. This is called Think Pink. Here is the swatch right there. This one is pretty wearable just on its own. Um, I do like this one a lot. Um, again, here it is on the lips. And, you know, compared to the other lipsticks at the drugstore, I really do like this shade and this formula with this kind of a light pink lip. So this one again was Think Pink. This one is kind of a fun one to wear. It's very kind of like blue based pink. This is 967 Dollhouse Pink. And there it is in the tube and it's quite fluorescent on the lips. It's really bright and fun. And there it is swatched on the hand and you can kind of see the comparison between the other ones. This one's the most blue based pink that they offer. I think that they have some new shades that they just released recently as well. So I would, I would check out Kmart first and then Walgreens because that's where I find um, the most updated lipstick collection. Now for a little bit um, brighter and darker than the rest. This one is 966 Don't Blink Pink. This one's really pretty. That's it swatched there and again on the lips. I do like this one a lot. It's um, a very nice pink but it's bright and it also has coral with it as well. So this next one I think would be a great transition from summer into fall. This is, this one definitely has um, more mauve-y kind of purpley tones to it. This is 907C Mauve Out of Here. So that's it swatched on the hand and the lip swatch as well. Lip swatches might start to get a little crazy and um, looks like I'm kind of going outside of my lip line. It's just because my lips are getting kind of red underneath, but the good thing about these is that they are so opaque that you can't even see any of my lip color underneath. So this one's kind of fun to wear. This is a really bright, kind of a pale pumpkin orange kind of a shade. This is 969 Carrot Gold. So there it is in the tube and on my hands and on my lips. This one has quite a bit more red to it. It's not as um, like bright orange. I mean, it's orange, but um, this one was definitely more of a lighter purple or purple, a lighter orange. And this one's more of like a reddish orange. This is 970 Pretty Persimmon. And I really like this one. That's it in the tube on the lips and the hand swatch. I think this one is absolutely gorgeous and your teeth look super white with this one. This is 916D Raven Raisin and there is the lip swatch or 
This is the hand swatch. This is the lip swatch. I think this looks great. I think this would look awesome in the fall. So if you're looking for a dark vampy lipstick, this one is freaking amazing. I do recommend a like the clear um, Milani lip liner with any of these next darker shades that I'm showing you, including this one, just because it can get slightly messy when you're applying it. This one is absolutely gorgeous. Here is the hand swatch here, so you can tell that it's not quite as um, opaque as the last one, and it's a little bit more wearable. I think this one kind of reminds me slightly of Max Rebel. I don't have it here to swatch um, for like a comparison, but it definitely reminds me of it. This is 908C Sugar Plum Fairy. I like this one a lot. Again, there it is there, and on the lips. If you want a really dark shade that's kind of borderline black, like just a really deep, beautiful shade, this one is absolutely stunning. I feel like I had this on my teeth. <laughs> um, I don't. I'm good. Um, this is 918D Cherry Bomb. So this is like, uh, what was that shade, like a year or two ago? Oh, you can hear those stupid jets flying over. Like oxblood kind of a shade. Like it's red, but it's brown, but it's really deep. So, yeah, that's it. This is it in the tube. And again, you can see like the comparison swatches on my hand. That's it at the very end. It definitely makes your teeth look super uber white. <laughs> And if you want a super deepened plum shade, super dark violet, this would be the lipstick that you're after. It's the last one here on the end. Um, I think that this could be wearable. You can definitely just dab a little on and then sheer it out with your finger and throw on like a clear lip gloss or something, or even like a purple lip gloss. But now, the outside edge of my lips is not perfect because I've had on 12 other lipsticks, but you can definitely tell it's not black, but it looks really close to it. Definitely a super dark purple, and your teeth look super white. <laughs> this is 919B Vamp It Up. You can definitely tell the difference between this is the packaging that's black and then you have the um, lipstick and as you can tell it's quite purple so I don't know if you're if you're up for it this would be kind of fun to wear I think is this would be really fun like sheared out on the lips but here's all the swatches of the wet my lipsticks that I have and yeah, they're super affordable. I highly suggest them. Um, Walgreens and Rite Aid typically always have either 40% off of Wet n Wild products or they have the buy one, get one 50% off. So you really can't beat these lipsticks at that price. But anyways, that's all I have for you guys today. And thank you guys so much for watching.